Hello beautiful people. Today I'm going to share with you my simple and low waist morning routine. So I've recently started airing out my bed first thing in the morning to reduce moisture and also prevent dust mites. If I had made this routine even six months ago, you would be watching me do a very vigorous workout right now, but more recently I've stopped moving in ways that I don't particularly enjoy, so instead of working out really hard to attain a body that I think is desirable, I have started moving in ways that just make me feel good. So this morning I am doing a sunrise yoga class with the climbing gym that I go to. I'm very fortunate that they have these free classes that we can all take virtually. I like to get up early because I have always been a morning person, although I've really changed my mindset about why I have created a morning routine. It definitely used to be more for productivity in, I would say, a more unhealthy manner. It was just about getting up as early as possible to get as much work done as possible. And now I really like to focus on waking up early, but using it as time for myself to recharge, to center myself so I can be my fullest self for the rest of the day, and I do know that I am very privileged to have the time to take care of myself every day in this way. I acknowledge that there is a lot of time privilege in all of this, so everyone needs to just do what they can, and hopefully we can all at least take a few minutes for ourselves every day just to show ourselves some loving kindness and some gratitude. After I finish my yoga, I like to do some meditation. Now, for the last 10 years or so, I've tried meditation on and off, and I was kind of at a point where I thought maybe it just wasn't for me, but actually in the last couple months, I found a YouTuber that I really enjoy, and he plays these vibrations, so I don't have to just focus on my breath, I can focus on the sounds, and that's really helped me not let my mind wander so much. And I will link his YouTube down below if you want to check him out. I have these coffee beans I got in bulk from our zero waste general store here in Chicago 
and I don't have a coffee grinder, but I use my Nutribullet to grind my beans and also for pretty much everything else I do in the kitchen. Today I am using my pour over and I don't always use it because my roommate has a drip coffee maker but it is definitely my favorite way of making coffee. I just love how I am a part of the creation of my beverage at every step. I don't just leave it to sit, I'm actually actively making my own coffee and I just think it tastes really good too. And this is my reusable coffee filter I got. Uh, this is actually a new one because my old one was getting very gross. So I can just compost the old coffee filter and also compost some of the grounds if I don't feel like making them into anything and just rinse the coffee filter and reuse it again next time. I usually have a pretty light breakfast. Today I'm having a cinnamon raisin bagel that I made earlier this week. I'll have to show y'all how to make bagels sometime. It's one of my favorite things. And just a few grapes that I got from my Imperfect Foods box. And now I'm going to journal. I just realized that my headphones are still in. I'm definitely likely listening to either a news podcast or just music. Each day I write down how I'm feeling just so I can get it on paper. I like to write an affirmation and then I also write down five things I am grateful for so I can find the positives even when I'm not feeling particularly positive. These are my current shower faves. I have this cleanser in a glass bottle, a shampoo and conditioner bar, a soap bar, and my beloved safety razor. I have a couple of skincare items. This first one is from The Ordinary. I like them because they're very inexpensive and packaged in glass. And then I have a moisturizer from Coco Kind. They're easy to find, they're at Target even. And they are also packaged in glass. And they smell really nice too. And then I have this balm from Yay for Earth. And it's a bit waxier. People use it as a moisturizer, but I just use it on my lips to add some moisture and on my brows to kind of hold them in place. I am a sunscreen fiend. <laughs> I think it's important for everyone to wear sunscreen. A favorite of mine is the mineral sunscreen from Sunbum, which you can also find at Target, Walgreens, those kinds of places, easily accessible. And their mineral sunscreen is reef safe, though it is packaged in plastic. And this is my deodorant from Meow Meow Tweet. It's in a compostable container. And then I've got my tooth tabs and my electric toothbrush, which 
isn't plastic, but it has lasted me a very long time. I've got some compostable floss as well, which, you know, I'm gonna spare you the visual of me using it. And that is it for my morning routine. Thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't yet, and I'll see y'all soon. Bye!